Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. On today's vlog, we are going to be showing you some pontoon boat restoration. So today, Matt is actually going to be restoring the tunes, which are the metal things right there. Um, an older pontoon boat, they are grimy and dirty, they have a lot of scratches, so he is going to use a sander to fix them up. So I'm going to send you on over to Matt, and he's going to show you kind of step by step what he's going to do. So here he is. All right, everyone, uh, going to start with sanding the pontoons. The first step in refurbishing this 12-year-old uh, pontoon, um, as you can see here, there's a lot of oxidation happening on the tunes. They were a lot worse, actually, prior to this, um, but I used some, I'll call it Tune Bright, that came from Fleet Farm. Uh, made by Sailbrite, uh, and it cleaned up the, the tunes pretty good, but I uh, still couldn't get everything off, so I'm going to sand these tunes down and then polish them. All right, uh, you can see I just finished basically four different phases of sanding. Uh, so this is pre-polish and a lot of that oxidation came out. Um, you can still see blemishes, but I'm hoping the polishing process is going to take care of that. And then you can see the comparison again. Look at how nasty this oxidation is here compared to after the sanding work here. Um, hopefully, hopefully the polish process uh, will bring a little shine out. Um, but I'm not going to do the polishing until after I get after this entire side. Then I'll do the other side um, just the same way. One day of sanding. The crazy thing is, I thought I was going to get all the way through polishing one side of the pontoons today, but I have only got through sanding off the first coat. As you can tell, all that oxidation did come off on the first cut. It's a very dirty job. But more to come, this gives me something good to do in the winter. So as Matt had said in the previous clip, this project actually is over multiple days, multiple weekends, hence the different shirts. He estimates that each pontoon took him about eight hours each, so about 16 hours total. So it's a lot of work that goes into really restoring them so they look brand new. I just showed a clip of Matt um, wetting down the pontoons. He's all done sanding it. He made it nice and smooth, took the hose, wet it down, and we're gonna use some pontoon cleaner to really kind of shine it up. So that's one of the final steps.
So here's the final product. Matt is all done sanding and buffing and doing all the steps he needed. So look how fantastic that looks. He tried to make it even more shinier and it just wasn't working out. Um, but actually I like this a little bit better because it matches like the metal on this part. So I actually don't want it to be shiny. So he did such a great job with it. It's really gonna look really, really nice in that water. It doesn't even look like a used pontoon boat. It looks brand new. So thank you for joining us. I hope you enjoyed this vlog where we are fixing up our pontoon boat. We have many more vlogs to come. We still have to do the floors and just a couple other things to the pontoon boat. Let us know in the comments down below, what do you think of the pontoons? Do you think that they look really great? Um, let us know, do you have any questions about the steps and stuff like that? We will be more than happy to answer all your questions. I hope you're having a fantastic week. Don't forget to join our adventure family by hitting that subscribe button down below. Also, don't forget to check out my complimentary channel, Ohana Adventures, where I explore my love of all things Disney. Again, thanks for joining us. And remember, it's a beautiful world out there, so go out there and find your adventure. See you real soon. Bye.